There is too much to be said about money. It is a luxury that for luxuries, a distinguishing beauty mark that has provoked many ill-conceived sojourn into deep, dark, and dry places of the world. The very same idea responsible for sparking instant love, interest, and passion. Those who refute the power of money have never fallen in love or inhaled the equally fantastic cloud of an exotic grass. With more and more people chasing the cloud across the desert sky, those who have tamed the furtive nimbus stand out. Honorable Kumle Shoname is one of such people. He is a Nigerian nationalist, pan-Africanist, philanthropist, politician, sportpreneur, business mongol, innovative and economic driver, quintential, ubiquitous, pragmatic, resourceful, bridge builder, destiny helper, community leader and pillar, enigma, motivator, great strategy par excellence, technocrat, a teacher, perfect role model for excellence, and a mentor. Honorable Kunle Shoname was born on 27th of April, 1966. After his elementary primary education, he attended Government College Lagos for his secondary school education and gained admission into University of Ife, now Obafem Awolo University, Ilefe, Oshun State, Nigeria, and graduated in 1988. He did his one year mandatory National Youth Service Club in Plateau State in 1989. While he was in service, he was a member of National Youth Service Corps State Football Team. He had his master's in business administration from Lagos State University in 1996. He fell into politics and was elected the first legal chairman of the Constitutional Local Council Development Area of Lagos State. Between October 2003 to October 2011, he performed excellently well while he was in office as the chairman of the Kodishia Local Council Development Area and his legacies are still there for all to see. He is the founder of Bet Niger, Nigeria number one online bookmaker company with the traded name KC Gaming Network Limited. Bet Niger covers all sports major events across Europe and the world at large. The lottery website is licensed under the Lagos State Lotteries Board, Lagos, Nigeria. He is the founder and the chairman of Value Jet Airline. He is the chairman of Tavisto Global Resources Limited. He is the chairman of Raymond Star Football Club. He is the top Nigerian to own a European football club, Portuguese club Deportivo Ferencis. He played amateur football and represented his school several in competition like Principal Cup, he has been involved in football marketing and politics, being in the forefront of helping Nigerian league and club get sponsorship. He is a sport visionary who strongly believes that Nigerian football can be better organized to be more attractive to fans and corporate brands. The life of a man is a congregation of everything he has been through and all he has to show for it. But more than all that, the thing he values gives a pretty intimate representation of who he is and can be. There are men of weight and substance who are Nigerians, but quite a few have managed to crawl into the hearts and homes of Nigerian youth. There is no contesting fact that Mr. Akumle Shoname is the most successful sports entrepreneur and the founder of Bet Niger. Nigeria number one online bookmaker company. All its life and devil hovered around sports. Why some believe that sport cannot be run successfully as a business venture here in Nigeria and in most African countries, it shattered that theory as he has succeeded so excellently where many other failed. He reneged on. He has never failed and he will never fail. Time is a unit of life. We are all on transit. Century had come and gone. Empire has risen and fallen. Life being a voyage. Both powerful and weak individuals transfers this universe. There were times when we were not here. We are here today. There will be a time when we will no longer be present here. But represented by our legacies, the shade, color, and imagination of memories that will be held about us depends solely on how judiciously and impactfully we use our time here while we still transiting. In order to make the world a better place, while we urge people to live a life of impact, we are morally obligated to celebrate 
those already living in that realm of positive legacy, entrenching indelible footprints on the sand of time and elevate them to Olympian hide where they'll be a touch bearer for those coming behind. Mr. Shonamen is port lover is a philanthropist extraordinary who doesn't play with anything that concerns Remo where he is from. There is so much he said to have done and is still doing for Remo Nation that all and sundry are actually grateful to him for. Given the vast wealth at his disposal, that man could decide to be the emperor of a few nations and several others will line up to have their national flag bearing his name. It's been pointed out that he is one of those folk without an active favor for Nigerian politics, yet he continued to swell in riches as though he didn't have a passion for the mystic metnics of that age-old sport. The man is more interested in, it seems, in actual sport betting, investment, and the uh, love of his life. It sings. Of responsibility, humility, and extreme down to the head and accommodating nature. His establishment, Bed Nigeria, is one of patronize the business enterprises in Nigeria. So vast is rich that the company almost single handedly sponsored the just concluded Big Brother Nigeria show. Judging from the intention and investment of renowned business and sport enthusiasts, he is building a multi-million naira stadium, the like of which are not only scars in gateway states. On this wise, he is an orthodox businessman and a die-hard proponent of sport and a man who pursues the growth and development of his roots and the welfare of the common man. The latest testament of his three ways regard for business, sport and community are the preparation underway for marking the completion of the multi-million Naira Sports Stadium in Ekene. The stadium stands as one of the hallmark of excellence and a good text for the residents of Ekene and the native of Ogun State and Nigeria at large. To those reasonably familiar with him and his pursuit, his multi-million Naira Stadium at Ekene is only the most recent of his many endeavors in promoting sport and grassroots development. Not to mention his founding of Bet Nigeria, which is explained as a strategic move to stave off the youth from crime and violence. Over 2,000 youth from six political zones of Nigeria have gathered at multi-million sports stadium in Ogun State, built by the renowned sport businessman and sport enthusiast on a reconciliation for the opportunity to showcase their skill and take their game to the next level. The program, which has seen top class agents from different parts of the world converge in the clinic to pick the next JJ, Okocha, Sunday Olise, Daman, Amokachi, Lionel Messi, Christian Ronaldo of this world, has been commended by all and sundries on citing the youth of different tribes and tongues converging in Ogun State to showcase their skill. People said this was a laudable project that must be emulated by Nigeria with resources to help our youth. He could have decided to keep his money in abroad or buy properties, but rather he had decided to invest in Nigeria and provide opportunity for the youth. His club, Remo Star, and other businesses are providing job and empowering youth of this country. His building company has turned Many youths, millionaires, creating job opportunity, but he is not resting on his oars. Rather, he is still creating avenues for many more. Currently, his Bet Niger company hasn't only availed a source of employment for Nigerian youth. Still, he has provided avenue for such work on development as amputee football female marathon, open marathon, and indoor sport. The underlying moral of Kunglesionamen's endeavor is live and help live, grow and help grow. Even now, Shonamen is renowned for being Africa's most successful sport business entrepreneur, the only one to own both indigenous football league club, Remostar FC, and is the first Nigerian to own a top European club 
in Portugal, Club Deportivo Ferences. He has shifted his gear to Avion Sector as he has planned to bring his mineral torch to lucrative sector with the Bertot Value Jet airline. He floated the airline in 2018 to provide a premium and high quality flight service in Nigeria and Africa to the amiable businessman and socialize anything worth doing at all is worth doing well. He has kicked off the full commercial operation of the value jet with the main sponsorship of the first 50 km Remo or Chuarez Holding in Homestead of Remo. It's great for someone to remember where he is from in life. He is doing so much in his community through football, giving back to society. If we have more Nigerians doing what he is doing, Nigeria will be a better place. Go out and touch lives in your community. Honorable Kuna is an acute optimist and a go-to individual when it comes to the development of sport from the stretch and taking it to the available height. He's a very successful businessman and sportpreneur who has continued to impact on life of Nigerian youth and society at large with his philanthropic gesture and immense contribution to the development of Nigeria football. His admirers in Nigeria and around the world are celebrating his philanthropic and valuable contribution to the development of sports in Nigeria, in Nigeria and Africa at large. He is one of the richest men we have in Nigeria today whose business initiatives has greatly impacted the economy, especially engaging the youth. The entire populace commended him for his effort in the socio-economic sector that has annexed and exposed the potentials of Nigerian youth through the various football programs under his private and corporate sponsorship. Due to his uh, immense contribution to the development of humanity and the nation at large, he was appointed as a patron of African Student Football Union. He was appointed a member of the Lagos State University Governing Council. He received an award at the Gala Night Award organized by the executives of Lagos State Nigeria Union of Journalists in 2020. In bid to make the society crime free, he donated vehicle to Nigerian police to assist in keeping the society safe. He contributed his quota to the fight against the rampaging COVID-19 pandemic that ravaged the world. In year 2020, the Ogun State Bomb billionaire made Dix known through his betting platform. A breakdown of his contribution shows that federal government got 100 million naira, Ogun State government got 50 million naira, and Lagos State government got 50 million naira. He has given back to the National Service Corps scheme that has given him so much by building a state of art cleaning fully equipped and donated to the National Youth Service Corps camp in Shagam, Ogun State. He donated a building structure to Blessed Assurance of Age Homes in the Kenerema, Ogun State as part of his support to the less privileged in Remo Ogun State, Nigeria. In 2007, he signed a 200 million naira sponsorship agreement with Nigeria Penultimate Men Football League, the Nigeria National League. In 2015, Ben Nigeria became official sponsor of Nigerian Women Football League. He made a donation of 10 million naira to kickstart the proposed athletic trust fund, an initiative of the Minister of Youth and Sport Development in this present political dispensation. He is an exemplar of this ideology, an entrepreneur marvel, calm, potential businessman, a renowned philanthropist, uses his legacy to engrave his name with gold on the path of life. As a grand master of the universe, God program his entrance into the physical realm in times and seasons. He knows that our tomorrow requires lighting the bulb into the future by getting information to make a rational decision, develop confidence, remove uh, emotion. It is equally important that we adopt innovation and strategic plan while focusing on business development, knowing crystal clear that future will be driven by nothing X but knowledge. He surrounds himself with positive, productive people of goodwill and decency. The key and mayor to growth and success in business is not so much of where he stands, but greatly on the direction he's moving. His life has not only been a success, 
but a huge inspiration to younger and upcoming generations. This is not the first time he is in spotlight because of his philanthropic gesture, as he is one of wealthy people in the country who have altruistic desire to improve human welfare. His life-changing activity are not restricted to helping sportsmen and ordinary Nigerians alone, but cut across practically all fixes of our national life. A just man, humble, brilliant, and a man who has knocked for the pursuits of excellence. Horrible Kuleshoname, symbol style billionaire, is a renowned philanthropist that has given hundreds of millions of naira to aid group organization and individual. He has shared the philosophy of our pine that what we have done for ourselves alone die with us. What we have done for others and the world remain as is immortal. He stands the chance of adding new description to his personality as a community pillar and a builder. He is a big inspiration to millions of people around the world. His lifetime is full of eloquent testimonies and also worthy of emulation. He is happily married to Mrs. Kemi Shoname and their union is blessed with the daughter, Eriolua. Thanks and God bless.